Hello Potter Puppets, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to focus on Harry Potter and the number seven. The number seven, as a lot of us know, does actually have a magical property and we will start with that in a second and the history of that number. But the number seven has been brought into Harry Potter a lot and there are a lot of us that know about the number seven because it has been brought up before. But there are probably a lot of things you didn't realise include the number seven too within the Harry Potter series. So I'm massively excited to talk about this with you guys. Haven't been through the list of the sevens that are within the Harry Potter series. I do know a lot of them, but I guarantee, because there's a lot here, that I'm going to pull up ones that I didn't realise. Before we get started though guys, if this is the first time you are seeing this face, hello and welcome to the channel. If you love anything magical and fun, then this is definitely the place for you. Join the magic and mayhem, hit subscribe, because I told you to. Also, a massive thank you to my channel members, you guys are awesome. Let's have a look. So I am on the Harry Potter wiki page. Starts off by saying seven was the most powerful magical number based on centuries of mythology, science and mathematics and therefore had a very important role in the wizarding world. Arithmancer Bridget Wenlock, Wenlock sorry, was the first to note this through a Theorem, th theorem, which exposed the magical properties of the number seven. So let's talk about this. So the it says again, the arithmetic said Bridget Wenlock was the first witch to establish the magical properties of the number seven. She wrote her groundbreaking theorem of the back of a sh on the back of a sugar packet using her usual invisible ink. She then proceeded to send her cousin a letter, forgot where she wrote the theorem and thought it was on the envelope. She hunted down the envelope and intercepted it at her cousin's house where she learned her mistake. Seven was the age by which most experts believe that magic would reveal itself in witch or wizard. So we're going to now move on to the list of the number seven seen in the wizarding world. So names, so you've got the word Horcrux itself contains seven letters in its name, Weasley contained seven letters, Granger contained seven, the following people had seven syllables in their full names, Ronald Billius Weasley, Hermione Jean Granger, Geneva Molly Weasley, Ginevra Molly Weasley, is that Ginevra? William Arthur Weasley, Percy Ignatius Weasley, Albus Severus Potter, Regulus Arcturus Black, Minerva McGonagall. The name Lily Evans and James Potter had seven syllables together. The, uh, uh, the arithmancy professor of Hogwarts was named Septima Vector. Her name was also seven letters long. Septimus Malfoy and Septimus Weasley had a shared first name that translated to seventh in Latin. Marvolo, Tom Riddle's name, had seven letters in it. If the letters of the alphabet were turned into numbers, A's, 1, B's, 2, etc., the letters in the name Harry would add up to 70. That's not seven, though, is it? You're reaching a bit there. If the letters of the alphabet um, were turned into numbers, A, 1, B, 2, added together until a single number was found, as done in arithmetic, the letters in the name Harry resulted in the number seven. Oh, okay, I see where they were going with it now then. So, Bridget and Wenlock, the first and last names of the person who established the magical properties of seven, both contained seven letters. Right, we're going to move on to birth. Molly and Arthur Weasley had seven children. Thaddeus Thurkle had seven children, all squibs. Walter Parkin had seven children. Violet Tillyman and Myron Otherhorse had seven children. Who knows that name? Pricing. Harry Potter paid seven galleons for his Wanda Ollivanders. There were seven letters in both sickles and galleons. That's really cool. Okay, moving on to Hogwarts. Children went to school at Hogwarts for seven years. There were seven floors at Hogwarts. There were seven core classes which were taught at Hogwarts. So you've got astronomy, charms, defence against the dark arts, herbology, history of magic, potions and transfiguration. 
The Marauders map showed seven secret passageways out of the school. The map did not show the room of requirement. Moving on to Quidditch, there were 700 fouls in Quidditch. There were seven players on a Quidditch team. team. There was a broomstick named Clean Sweep 7. Yes, I remember that one. Harry caught seven golden snitches during his time as Seeker. Didn't know that one! First year Gryffindor versus Slytherin and Gryffindor versus Hufflepuff. Second year Gryffindor versus Slytherin. Third year Gryffindor versus Ravenclaw and Gryffindor versus Slytherin. Fifth year Gryffindor versus Slytherin. Sixth year Gryffindor versus Slytherin. That's really cool, I didn't know that. Okay, potions. The Wolfsbane potion had to be drunk every seven days before the full moon. Harry Potter, the alternate instructions in the Half-Blood... Oh, sorry. Harry followed the alternate instructions in the Half-Blood Prince's copy of Advanced Potion Making by instead stirring his potion once clockwise after every seventh stir anti-clockwise. This helped him achieve much better results than the standard instructions and earn Slughorn's praise. So to do that after every seventh turn to go out it obviously again it's magic isn't it so it's helped magically so yeah that's really cool there were seven ingredients of polyjuice potion fluxweed not grass lacewing flies leeches powdered bicorn horn shredded boomslang skin seven a piece of the person that wanted to turn into usually hair the Wizarding School Potions Championship was held every seven years on years divisible by seven. That's so cool. Books and publications. So Gilderoy Lockhart assigned seven books for his students in the 1992-1993 school year. Break with a Banshee. Gadding with Ghouls, Holidays with Hags, Travels with Trolls, Voyages with Vampires, Wanderings with Werewolves and Years with the Yeti. Hermione Granger stated that Alohomora was in Chapter 7 of the Standard Book of Spells. There were most likely seven Standard Book of Spells, one for each year. Okay, Spells, the unforgivable, unforgivable Curses were first classified as unforgivable in 1717. Many spells such as Protego, Reducto, Imperio, Expulso, Depulso, Anapneo and Stupefy had seven letters in their incantations. There were seven known spell types, Transfiguration, Charm, Jinx, Hex, Curse, Counterspell and Healing Spell. And then miscellaneous bit, the prophecy about Harry Potter defeating Tom Riddle noted that the one with the power to vanquish the Dark Lord approaches, born to those have thrice thrice defied him born as the seventh month dies and the dark lord will mark him as as his equal in the wizarding world wizards and witches came up at the age of 17 instead of 18 seven people came out of the shrieking shack in 1994 after serious black's innocence and peter pettigrew's crimes were revealed harry potter ron hermione pete pettigrew serious black Ramus Lupin and Severus Snape. There were seven obstacles leading up to the Philosopher's Stone. <coughs> Sorry. Fluffy. Uh, Devil Snare. Flying Keys. Giant Chest Set. Quirrell's Troll. Potion Riddle. Snake's Potion Riddle. And the Mirror of Erised. Uh, the Philosopher's Stone was kept in Vault 713 in Gringotts Bank. It's just got the number seven. Let's reach in. Let's reach in. It's got the number seven in it but it's just reaching. Seven entities were attacked by the Basilisk during the 1992 and 1993 school year. Mrs Norris, Colin Creevy, Justin Fletchley, Nicholas de Mimsy Porpington, Hermione Granger, Penelope Clearwater and Harry Potter, but not petrified. There were seven snakes on the door of the Chamber of Secrets. I do remember that one very well. There were seven locks on Professor Moody's trunk. There were seven potion bottles in the last task in the Philosopher's Stone Chambers. Seven muggles saw Ron and Harry in the flying Ford Anglia. Seven keepers for every dragon for the first task of the Triwizard Tournament. Mr Weasley won 700 galleons in the Daily Profit draw. From the Great Hall, Harry, Ron and Hermione climbed seven staircases to reach the tower that houses Professor Trelawney's classroom at the top. The Battle of the Seven Potters occurred on 27th of July 1997. Harry was introduced to the Order of the Phoenix when it had nine members, but he did not know who seven of them were beforehand. 
Blaise Sabini's mother had been married seven times as of 1996. Likes wedding cake. Snape removed 70 points from Gryffindor when Harry showed up at Hogwarts late in 1996, 50 for lateness and 20 for Harry's muggle attire. Dumbledore showed Harry seven memories about Voldemort's past, including both the fake and real Horcrux memory. Voldemort made seven Horcruxes. He deliberately created six Horcruxes to create a seven fragment soul, including the piece of soul in his body. The singular noun of the word Horcruxes, Horcrux, is seven letters long. Tom Riddle's diary, Marvel O'Grant's ring, Rowena Ravenclaw's diadem, Salazar Slytherin's locket, Helga Hufflepuff's cup, Harry Potter, unintentionally and unknown to Voldemort, and Nagini. There were seven Potters during the Battle of the Seven Potters, Harry, Ron, Hermione, Fred, George, Fleur and Mundungus. There were also seven main conflicts in Harry Potter's perspective between 1997 and 1998, the latter part of the Second Wizarding World War, the Battle of the Seven Potters, Infiltration of the Ministry of Magic, Attack of Godric's Hollow, Ambush at the Lovegood's House, Battle of Malfoy Manor, 1998 break-in of Gringotts Wizarding Bank and the Battle of Hogwarts. Seven prisoners, not including Dobby, escaped from Malfoy Manor, Mr Ollivander, Luna, Dean Thomas, Griphook, Harry, Hermione and Ron. Harry, Potter and Ron Weasley received seven owls for their ordinary wizarding level examinations. Hermione Granger continued with seven subjects during her sixth year. Harry helped Gryffindor beat Slytherin for the House Cup for the first time in seven years. Sybil Trelawney believed that the seven of spades meant an ill omen. When a wizard turned seven years old, they started showing mag magical properties. Frank Bryce was nearing his 77th birthday when he was murdered by Voldemort. The Tri-Wizard Tournament in 1994 took place seven centuries after the first one. On Christmas Day of 1994, after receiving socks as a present from Harry, Dobby told him that he now had seven pairs of socks. In 1996, Bellatrix Lestrange asked Severus Snape seven questions regarding to his loyalty to Lord Voldemort. Where was he when Lord Voldemort fell? Why did he never make any attempt to find Voldemort? What has he been doing during the period between Voldemort's fall and rebirth? Why did he stop Voldemort from procuring the Philosopher's Stone? Why did he not return to Voldemort immediately when all Death Eaters were summoned? Where was he during the Battle of Department of Mysteries? Why is Harry Potter still alive despite being under his mercy for five years? Harry Potter's Chocolate Frog Cars stated that he was famous for seven reasons, being the first and only known wizard to have survived the killing curse, being the youngest seeker in a century having gained a spot on the Hogwarts Gryffindor Quidditch team in 1991 at only 11 years old, finding and opening Salazar Slytherin's Chamber of Secrets in his second school year and defeating the monster within, which was a basilisk, being the youngest competitor of the Triwizard Tournament and winner of said tournament in 1995, being the only known Gryffindor student that can speak parcel tongue, being the last master of death to have united the three Deathly Hallows, defeating the most powerful and dangerous dark wizard of all time, Lord Voldemort, in 1998. Nicholas Flamel was seven years older than his wife. So there's even like little things and I didn't know that one. During Harry's hearing in the Ministry of Magic in 1995, Dumbledore stated that clause of this decree of the reasonable restrictions, hang on, that, let me start again. Dumbled during Harry's hearing in the Ministry in 1995, Dumbledore stated that clause seven of the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery allowed the use of magic in life-threatening situations. <gasps> There was a total of seven known registered anime, an, anime in the 20th century. I'm so sorry, I'm tripping over words now. Minerva McGonagall became an animagus by the age of 17. One of the ingredients for the animagus potion was a silver teaspoon of a dew that had not seen sunlight or been touched by human feet for seven days. Wendelin the Weird was captured and burnt at the stake 47 times. Again, that one's reaching a bit. I, in my eyes. In Harry Potter's copy of Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, he wrote in the pixie section of the classification and put seven X's. Okay, and then we have got... Oh, I've lost where I am. Behind the scenes, the author's last name, J.K. Rowling's last name, Rowling, contains seven letters. 
dates. The first book was released in 1997 and the final book was released in 2007. The epilogue itself is set in 2017. Many fans expected Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows to be released on 7th of the 7th 2007, which also happened to be a Saturday, the day upon which Harry Potter books had previously been released. However, it was released on July 21st of that year instead, two weeks later. It is thought that the more magical date was rejected due to it also being the second anniversary of the 7-7 London bombings in 2005. 21 is still a multiple of seven though. On 7th of August, the Harry Potter series won seven awards at the 2011 Teen Choice Awards for Deathly Hallows Part 1 and 2. The Battle of Hogwarts um, on 2nd of May, the second day of the fifth month, 2 plus 5 equals 7. The first film in Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them tri trilogy is set 70 years before the Harry Potter series. The launch livestream of Hogwarts Legacy occurred on 7th February 2023. Its release year adds up to 7, 2 plus 0 plus 2 plus 3 is 7. Okay, that's really cool. Chapters. There are 17 chapters in the first book. Counting the epilogue, there are 37 chapters in the seventh book. The first years enter the castle in the seventh chapter of the first book. Chapter four of Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows is entitled The Seven Potters. There are seven books in the Harry Potter series and eight films. The number seven is everywhere. It's absolutely everywhere within Harry Potter, within the Wizarding World. And number seven does seem to be a very magical number. And to say that it's used in, like when we've said about the potions, Harry going by his own version of the, well, it's not his own version, but the half Lord Prince's Advanced Potions book and did every seven times went anti-clockwise. So the number seven is actually incorporated into spells potions it's really clever i really i think there is some more that are not on this list but i can't think off the top of my head what they are and it's going to do my head in but if you know any that i have not read out on there list them in the comments and we'll read them thank you so much for joining me tonight though guys it's been fun to look at this because i do love the theories and things with harry potter and it's a video, it's a sort of video I haven't done in a while, so it was really nice to go back and do something like this, and there will be more of this coming on the channel. But I'm gonna go, thank you for joining me once again. You know I love your company. Have a chit chat with me in the comments about this, especially if you know one that I haven't read out, and I will speak to you all in my next video. Bye, Potter Poppets.